Welcome to the channel, I'm Jay Malone. Today, let's talk about how I pass the part 107 test. If this is your first time to the channel and you enjoy photography, drones, technology, and other related things, then start off by hitting that subscribe button. When you do, tap the little bell icon next to it, that way you won't miss anything. If you plan on doing any type of commercial drone work here in the United States, you have to get your remote pilot certificate. And to get this, you have to pass a 60 question, multiple choice test. Most people call it the part 107 test. I took this test over a year ago and I passed on my first try. Now I'll tell you the questions aren't super difficult, but they're a little bit tricky. You take this test on a computer at an FAA authorized testing location and you have two hours to take this test. Pretty much all of the information that you need to pass this test could be found on the FAA's website if you know where to look. And if you want to compile all the information yourself, then you can probably pass it without any other training. Now let me read you some of the topics that are included in this test. The topics include aerodynamics, aeronautical decision-making, risk management, the national airspace system, sectional charts, airport operations, weather theory, weather charts, emergency procedures, and of course, the FAA regulations covered in part 107. So that's a lot of information to take in and a lot of information to cover. So how did I pass on the very first try? I'll tell you. I used gold seal training. You can find them at uavgroundschool.com. Now this video is not sponsored by them, so this is just what I used and I highly recommend it. The training was great. The lessons are all broke down into categories. It's kind of uh, multimedia type lessons, uh, interactive lessons. So I, I learn a lot of stuff visually instead of just reading. And these lessons were great to actually apply all of this information in a visual aspect that made it a lot easier for this country boy to learn. And with Gold Seal training, after you do the lesson, you can take a quiz on that lesson. That way you know how you are, how you stand, if you need to go back and retake the lesson then, uh, you can do all of that at your own pace. And when you've gone through all of the lessons, take one of their practice tests. You can take as many practice tests as you need to. They even have a final exam test with questions that are very similar to the same questions that was on the test. And when you take their final exam test, you can even print out a certificate that says you completed the gold seal training. And the customer support is great. There's even a Facebook group that you can join that many people are discussing and can help you out with any questions that you might have. The instructors at Gold Seal have been in the business of training pilots for a long time, and they're really good at knowing how to get this information to sink in. That way you can remember it for the test. I told the guys at Gold Seal about my YouTube channel and about all of you guys, and they offered a coupon code just for you so you can save money on this gold seal training. The coupon code is easy. It's just Malone, M-A-L-O-N-E. I don't get anything for you using that code. I just wanted to save you some money and the people at gold seal were kind enough to pass along that coupon code. They even have a guarantee that you'll pass the test or they'll pay for it. Click on the link in the description below this video to check out uavgroundschool.com. And let me know down in the comments below, have you already taken this test or do you plan on taking this test? Thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And until next time, God bless.